In this video, we kick off a series where we play Germany's removed and very rare wonder tanks. From prototypes that are loosely based off tanks that existed in real life, like this Panther with night vision, to a Panther with double barrels adapted to shooting down aircraft, 190 ton steel beasts, and let's not forget, a tank that can level a small village with a single round. So to start this series off with a bang, we're going to play none other than the King Tiger 105. Hi guys and welcome to the first episode of Germany's Removed Wonder Tanks. Today of course we are kicking things off with the Tiger 2 105, but there are many of these to cover and of course I'm going to be doing an episode on this every single day. Now, I've been working on this for a very long time, so if you don't want to miss an episode, make sure you're subscribed and if you like the idea of this series, make sure you like the video as well. We have a lot of vehicles to cover over the next week, so let's get things started. This is the Tiger 2 105 and it was removed because well, it didn't really exist. There were, of course, drawings and blueprints for this thing, but it looks nothing like the drawings do, and Gaijin just came up with this because there was a plague of Russian heavy tanks when this thing was actually top tier, so it needed to be done. So, more than seven years have passed now since this thing was at top tier, and now, sadly, it's been relegated to the event vehicle and premium side of the tech tree. Now, I'm not here to argue why it was removed, because Gaijin does what Gaijin does. I would like to see this thing come back so that people can get access to it, much like every single vehicle in this series. But the long and short of this thing is, it's basically a Tiger II with a 105mm barrel. Except that's not really the case for one very neat feature this thing has over the Tiger IIH, it has itself a rangefinder. Click on the x-ray here, you'll see these little bug eyes on either side. That means when you hit your rangefinder button, it won't set the crosshair for you, but it will give you a very accurate reading out to 1800 meters with an expert crew of where you need to put your shot. This is actually an incredibly powerful tool, especially combined with this thing's firepower. And although the 105 doesn't look like it has much more penetration than the 88 does on the standard King Tiger, this thing packs a punch. 251 millimeters of penetration and it has almost 350 grams of TNT equivalent. Then, due to the round's weight, it can punch through angled armor much more efficiently than the 88 does. And the positives don't change there either. This thing has 900 horsepower, that's 200 horsepower more than the Tiger 2H, although it weighs a little heavier, that doesn't really matter, it's still faster. And on top of this, it also has an extra crew member in the turret, which means more meat for the meat shield. The only real drawback, honestly, is the fact that it has a much longer reload speed, that's an extra 5 seconds. So other than that, this is just a better King Tiger all round. For this series, I'm going to change nothing with my formula. I'm going to play the tank how I want to play the tank, and how I want to play this tank is at range, using the rangefinder, to get some long range yeets. In reality, this tank would have been sitting back well over a kilometer pinging tanks at extreme long ranges. So that's exactly what we're going to do. And just in case we get revenge bombed, we'll be coming back and another wonder weapon itself. This is the Horton 229 V3. We gotta get rid of that Cass. So let's get into battle and I'll show you how I got on. Totally didn't crash my nuke plane into a church. Alrighty, we are on the smallest map in War Thunder. This is Baby Ardennes, and it is not a full up here for once. It's 7-3. Uh, There's nowhere really safe for us to go. So I'm going to put myself out this direction to catch off flankers. That, is that area in play up there? Yes, that's bad. I know in top tier, like, people go up on that hill shooting to respawn here. Um, I don't think I can get there safely because this is a big open field. So, our plan is to stop people getting up there in the first place. This is the losing side of the map, as we like to call it, because more than often or not, you'll just lose because of how the map is designed. It's a problem with uh, asymmetrical maps, right? We have a, a Rotol. Right, let's back off now. I think something just fired from up there. Rat. Ratil. Not Ratol. Ratil. Yeah, someone is up there firing a couple of things now, actually. Can we see this man? Somewhat. 
Okay, T-82 is gone, and then there's another one there. So far, so good, dude. So far, so good. Airplane coming in, no. Bad news. I don't know what that is or where he is, but he's got a good rate of fire. There's too many trees in the way. Is that a band cannon? Okay, he's dead. No need to worry about that anymore. And we've got more up on this hill. Another beacon! There! That's the one! Some nice overpressure. We like that. And there's another one to his right. I don't know what he is, but currently there's a plane coming in and I think we're getting strafed. Well, not me specifically, but my team. And we got an overpressure on the... No, we didn't. We basically solid shot at that guy. Is that an enemy that was there? Oh, this is our problem. I set him on fire. He might come back around for the bomb revenge. Although I didn't see him carrying any. That's an issue. But he's dropped his bombs, right? I don't have uh, the elevation on my guns to do anything to him. Where did the guy I set in fire go? Okay. He's gone. Teammates now attacking this guy. There's two of them. There was another band cannon. Oh. There's some sort of SPG again up there. Reloading. Hey, super purging maybe. Too many airplanes. Wait, where was the screen tracer coming from? I think a teammate mainly, okay. T44's above me. Oh god. Who are you? Um Yeah. Too high. This guy's pushing us all. He just got shot. He just fired. Quite confident peeking him now. Teammate took care of it. Right, back up here again. Two things. Oh. One of them's a problem. Okay, I tracked the guy with six crew, which is our SPG. There's another one here. What is that, a Hori? Terrible shot. No, it's a... Uh, SU-122-54 I think We're at the ground I think of a fire here It is exactly what I thought it was He's gonna be staring at me or this Jagdpanther and this aeroplane keeps coming trying to kill one of us anyway gonna load our horizontal drive that's gonna put him out of the fight for a wee minute he's actually driving down towards us never mind he gone right can we take care of this guy now put him roughly here that aeroplane ricochet uh, I mean we're a 105 right not a 128 did he move? Or am I tripping? Oh, he's here. We're, we're losing though really badly. Okay, track. Oh, we're getting the cap now. I don't want to go help that Jagdpanther because he's in a really risky spot. But I, I can help him repair by making sure nobody kills him. The man that I tracked will be moving shortly. I suspect. We're losing here again. But I don't see who's taking it. Another two coming down over there. I hit that guy too low. Alright, there's a couple of heat eaters coming now. The Ag Panthers just hit the PT. 
ITT dead. Bad. Okay, we're good, we're good. I actually can identify what that is. Teammate just shot him. It's British. It's a tea eater. Are we getting bombed now? What are you? Oh, he got tracked or something as soon as I fired. He smoked, that's good. He's roughly here. Ah, he hit his turret ring. Okay, another 2 s 3 m gone. What was that scene there that was firing at? You probably saw it, it was like little pixels. Still there, it's a Charlie. How are you not dead, dude? I just didn't have enough armor to trigger my gigantic 105. Holy moly. I've been playing this one spot the entire match. He smoked up again. Oh, somebody else smoked him up. Right, now he's gone. We're on eight, but I only have five shells left. Another one up the top. It's a T-44. Okay. Another one there. No one else tried to come down this side, right? I I'm really surprised we haven't been bombed yet. I I'll be honest. The Egg Panther got the other guy. It was another Rital 90. We're capping. There are very few enemies left. There's another guy up here. There we go, we got the overpressure. Actually, we got ammunition exploded. What you want to do with a shell this big at this much energy is hit something solid in the tank where your APHE will actually fuse. The IL-2's coming back in again. I don't know who he's going for. I'm going to sink my hull down into this crater. So I can get more elevation, he's already getting shot at. He is very dead, dude. Good job, Oswin, too. He's slammed into the ground. Okay, let's get moving. I feel like we've done our team some justice here. Most of the things we fired at, we've just had too much gun. That's an IS-2. I did not get the track. Give this man a wee bit of angle. Okay, down he goes, dude. We have a nuke. Let's do it. There was an enemy jet, though. It's probably a stroke master. Yeah, it's a plane strafing. There's a MiG-9 he's dead. It was a MiG-9. I'm gonna hit this tree. Okay, yeah, we're okay. <laughs> that one, I mean, an absolute disaster. I've never nuked the tiniest map in War Thunder before. This is a first. The enemy tickets are bleeding extremely fast, though. Like, way, way faster than usual, actually. We need the enemy to get a kill or something just to delay the ticket bleed a wee bit more but I don't think it's going to happen. Oh, a guy's in a plane, that's why that's bleeding so fast. He's in a plane and he's not coming for me. Let's get Bombay door open. I might just slam this into the ground while I bomb. SU-6. Oh no. Yeah, that's a problem. Probably shouldn't have done that. Let me drop, dude. Out of bombs. I'm gonna... It's gonna hit me again. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're good, dude. <laughs> Holy moly. And that's so weird. The kill cam looks bizarre. You can still see all the people's names. 
And they're still like driving about too by the looks of it. Yeah, they're still firing and stuff. What? Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's the weirdest nook kill cam I think I've ever seen, dude. Well, there you go. Did I get the thing? Yeah, I got the doomsday, so I guess it counted. There you go. GG. Right, dude, we're starting to take some extra shells. As you can see, it's at least a 7-7 seven, seven game. Yeah, it's a 7-7 seven, seven game. But we're on another tiny version of a map. I'm really sorry that I hit the brakes, but I don't have any. We are going to go over this side. Actually, this is not Baby Maginot, it's actually Big Maginot. It's just that it's single cat. I wonder if there's somewhere we can sit and use a rangefinder. And just do big yeets, man. That's all I wanted to do in this. That was the idea. Is snipe things with a big gun. There's a BTR-80 going A. Our AMX-13 scouted him. We got a pack wagon going a way out. Left, no, that's not a pack wagon, it's just a normal 50mm one. Right, we got some machine gun fire happening over here as well. Some silent artillery. You'll love to hear it. T-44 just destroyed our little Puma. No big loss there, honestly. But the T-44 is going to be a struggle at range. Unless we get a side shot, in which case it will not be a struggle at all. Right, AMX-13, you deal with the small lighty stuff and I will do my best to get the heavy things. Some just fired at him. What is that? It's a Rattol. I think it's a Rattol 20 even. Panzer. Oh yeah, dude. That's what we want. That's exactly what we want. Oh no. A thousand. But he's got heat. Oh. <laughs> yes, dude. Okay. We're, we're on one, dude. We're on one. Right, AMX 13. I really need to be careful where I'm driving out here because. What are you got here? That is an IS-2. We are going to go lower play on him next time. So a little bit lower than we were before, but he can easily take us out. He's actually backing off now. I'm going to leave my rangefinder on 800 because it's just going to make it easier for us to adjust to things that are further away. i seen an SPG up there earlier, but I think he's moved on elsewhere. What are you shooting at? That IS-2 probably won't peak that same side again. But we have the cap, so that's really good. Still nothing yet. Oh, big boy. What was this again? A thousand, right? Okay, no real damage. You got his 50 cals, I guess. That's something. But be scared of that, dude. It's a T29, I believe. Okay, I almost got his machine gun port. We actually have a similar reload to that guy. I want him to shoot so I back off again. Actually, honestly, cut it cheek. Too high. Shoot me back, didn't I? I want him to panic fire at me. Yeah, the building. He thinks I'm just a normal King Tiger, doesn't he? Too much to the right that time. Right, we probably shouldn't re peek him anymore. My AMX 13 is still alive here. What are you fighting, little guy? Let's see. Big Papa King Tiger, I'll see if we can do anything. Okay, it was a T-34, he's gone. That is an M18. What are you doing here, little guy? Absolutely popped. And there was another one back there, I didn't make a mental note of it. 
I kind of had food poison the past couple of days. Uh, and my brain is erratic, man. To say the very least. So far, so good, though. We haven't even taken a shot yet. The best armor is uh, not getting hit at all. Oh, my teammate just got rocked beside me. Ah, oh, I see you. Can we get a read in here? 1300. Oh my god, dude. We went through the river on M47. I got you, little guy. You just chill out there. I, I got the man that hurt you. I'm your bigger, older, very older, actually. German cousin. It's all good. You'll be fine. We're putting a we're putting a band-aid on him, dude. A little uh, a little one with dinosaurs and stuff on it. You are very welcome, Gaiva. Very welcome. Yeeting that M forty seven was nuts, dude. I would be pretty upset if that happened to me. We got another here, right? Or is that just a tree in the distance? There's a tree in the distance. We're we're winning a lot. And it looks like the reason we're winning is we got uh okay. We just saw many poppins in a tank there. Okay, you tracked them. He he's aware that I exist now, unfortunately. That's what we like, dude. The Rizzler. He's gone. Right, where's Mary Poppins gone? And the Scorpion. Who knows? Who knows? I don't think they're getting the B-cap back, do you know that? Even though they've got many, many left. We, we seem to be thinning the herd a bit too much for them to make a push back. But this has certainly been some uh, big yeets, dude. Big yeets. Oh, we might have an opportunity here. We absolutely do. It's an M46. 900. And absolutely obliterated, dude. Unlucky Dennis. Sorry, dude. You got range finded. I'm actually surprised no one flanked up here yet because we're not actually quite thin in the ground over that way. I don't think the enemy team's gonna be able to make a push anymore. Did my little AMX die? Yeah, he did. He died to somebody there. No one is going to push out here either. And my little AMX is gone, dude. My Tiger 2 ages didn't work down there as well, though. That might have been the IS-2 from earlier. That we seen. Aha, uh -huh, there's Mary Poppins. No gun depression. Hi, Mary. Wait, I played I Spy and we won the game. I don't know if we're going to get anyone that tries to rush the cap towards the end of this match, so I am going to push up a wee bit. Yeah, we just got this whole ridgeline defended, man. And even though we were far back, we are actually top of the team with uh, kills. 7.7, 7, by the way. No problem at all. I still do prefer, I think, the 88 over this one, just because the reload speed, but it is very nice having the laser rangefinder. But at some point this week, we're going to be playing the Panther 2, which is the long 88 with the same rangefinder on. So we'll see how that performs in comparison. I think I'll prefer it, but I could be proven wrong, then. I'm open minded with this. I L2 fail. Not even a single crew member lost, dude. Not a single module damaged. A nice, easy 7 piece, dude. Let's go, GG. Alright, dude. We are another tiny map. 
the smallest version of Normandy. Okay, we are going to go up here. Sounds good. It's a terrible idea, but I don't want anyone getting up at top here because you just spawn cam you. We've just been in operation. Don't get spawn camped. Two maps in a row now. And then I had the luckiest unlucky nuke ever. Yeah. Yeah, hitting the church was not my intention. But it happened. Oh. Are we getting shot at? Oh yeah. Look. Things. I don't know what he is. Oh, there's more things. Alright, engine track radiator on that guy. Who is it you that's hitting me? Hey, I'm Kinda handy having a range finder, are you? Right, he's done for. This guy... It was a Type 99. I'm glad he's gone. Oh, I see you now. Wait! Is it the Sheridan? I think it is, you know that. Another 800 shot. Oh, it's a T-44. He's like... Relatively stationary, but also not at the same time. Oh no. An IS-2. I'm ranged, so... All I need to do is hit him now. Stop moving. Oh, he's gone. Yeah, th this is a T-44 now that's firing at me. We have, we have the cat. Unbelievable, Jeff. We got friends on our side though, so that's probably why we got it right now. Hmm. I've actually got a good angle here, but I keep missing targets because I've got so much to watch. Uh, gunner loader is it's an issue on the P. That T44 still scouted by there. So it looks like we're not going to be engaging anything less than 800 meters away. By the looks. Yeah, the T4400 is still back there, man. I don't know. What was that? Don't do that. Who is shot at me? I am baffled, confused, miffed. It's another 105 Tiger. Did I, that T44 is the one I come this way. Yeah, the S100P that I failed to get the killing blow on is uh, now killing my teammates. What the hell was that? Oh, there's a guy coming down the road. In a light tank, no less. Oh, yeah, I see one. Oh, it's a big boy. A Giga Chungus. Right, we're set to 800 again, right? Let's see if we can ding this guy's turret. There we go. Oh my god! A T26 E5 and I went through his manlet. Oh, he's upset, dude. Oh, it's a Ratal 20. My tiger is shooting him, but he's probably overpairing. He's dead. The tiger machine gunned them. Okay, of course he did. Hey. Nice, dude. 152. There's another Type 99 somewhere. Look at the Doom Toy Toys. What are you doing? This psycho. I want to see if we can get a nice wee corner shot on that guy. There we go, dude. We're getting it done. I think the T4400 hit me again, so I'm just going to back off. Doom Turtle down. Issue on the piece, also dead. Actually, did I get an assist for that guy? Okay. The T44 had pushed up quite a bit here. And I don't know what that thing is. Oh, it's a BTR. Of course it's a BTR. Toy Toys. That is the first Type 99. A Hori. Missed my opportunity, sadly. 
Uh, T4400 is annoying. I have to kind of ignore him for now because I think that we actually have a shot on this dude who scouted. No, he's behind a building. Oi. Oh, that's a chungus, man. Is that an IS-4? Yeah, it sure looks like one. I still don't see the T-44 on though. My Tiger H is on the cap, but he's getting pushed by an IS-4, so that won't last, I don't think. Is that IS-6? Okay, I'm much less scared though. In fact, I'm just not scared at all. What I'm scared of is Mr. T-44 who's still there. Uh, Roo's down there as well. This game's lasting quite a while because the cap's been contested for such a long time. Um, I, I can't get a clear shot on Mr. IS-6, so I'm actually going to reverse back, actually. I can see him now, but I just can't hit him. If you're wondering why I'm backing up into this, it's so I can reverse fast away. Oh damn, dude. That probably should have pinned him, but obviously it did not. Uh oh. Did I juke him enough? I did, dear. Yeah. I think that I was gonna go forwards and then just immediately hit the brakes once he started rolling. But I think he can set me in fire with his guns. And that's going to be very annoying. Hey, you big fella. Terrible shot. we wait till we're reloaded and we'll give that another go. Actually, I don't see him now. Oh, he's kind of on his side. Ah, he's reversed. And I... I can't see the guy behind the windmill too. I probably should go back to where I was. The IS-6 is out of cover now. But, and my Tiger 2P is gone too, by the way. That's not good. Oh, Hori production's gone. I thought there was someone rolling up by me, but we're okay. Right, cannon barrels out in the IS. That is going to die today, yep. Super Hellcats. And... There's an IS-3 coming. Where is the IS-3 gone? Someone is here as well. Probably the T-44. Yeah, we got him. Finally, dude. The thorn in my side. Right. This guy... Oh, hey. It's a BTR. I'm actually not going to shoot at him. I think it's going to be a waste. Oh, I see the IS-3's roof. I did hit it, but it just hit it a bit too low. Someone's on the road. That guy bringing that IS-3 up is dangerous because they hold the cap now. And he can just defend it really easy with that. Am I being pushed? Hold on. I'm getting to safety before I try and listen out. No, it's my teammate. The IS is still there, I think. They've reinforced this cap really well. Okay, IS-6 gone. Might 
be able to try and make a move myself now. But we're rolling right up into an IS-3. That'll be him? Oh yeah, definitely. Keep on coming, big man. Nice. Okay, that's one very scary thing that we had to worry about. No longer have to worry about him. There are six enemies left. We got nine shells, plenty of them. We just need a cap now, we're getting rocketed. I even just wanted a little bit of tickle of damage on that guy, but got nothing. Someone is firing down towards the ACAP. We're probably going to get bombed or rocketed here. So I'm just pushing the open field so I've repositioned at least. And now I can turn onto the cap, at least decap it. Yeah, my tiger is gone. Right, see if we can snatch this. Right, one guy coming up the road apparently. But the, there was a guy shooting past this church. There he is. It's another IS something. I tried to track him but I missed. We're going to die to bombs probably. Moving out. Yeah. Yeah, I thought that was going to happen, but we decapped, and that's the important thing. Right, let's go try and take these airplanes out, shall we? <laughs> this is going to be tough. Right, we're flying in with our beautiful eSports skin. We got from Twitch Drops. So we got to keep the sky clear. We got to keep enemies off the ACAP. We are thin in the ground for allies, but we are holding out. Okay, 12 minutes left to go. It's going to be fine, dude. It's going to be fine. Two planes up. One less by the looks of it. Yep. So 185 to deal with. But we got a 262 and there's us as well. Where is the 185? I'm not scared of a 185. What I am scared of is a good anti-air player. They're going to take A and we don't have anyone pushing the cab right now. Okay, weird choice. All he had to do was roll because we have no rudder and he would have been fine. I think my teammates are taking care of this guy. I'm going to make sure that they do. He's just smoked right now. Extremely inaccurate this thing. Right, he's down. Let's see if we can guide our team to the ACAP. Uh, IS-6 again, another one. I can pen him easily, but whether I can do him actual damage is another thing. He looks to be immobile right now. Big bomb. Nice, dude. Okay. Let's get after this IS-6 again. Although I, I cannot see him right now. There he is. Nice. That's awesome. Right, we just need someone on the cap. T-44-100 again. Enemy aircraft. Missed. I'm just going to keep pulling with this guy. He's a P-51H, I think. I don't have a lot of bullets left. We're good. We are good, dude. Right, T-4400 shooting at me. Panther needs to get to the cap, but the T-4400 is pushing up. What is shooting? Oh, it's a helicopter anti here. Okay, then. Nice. We're getting basketballed right now by an anti here though. I don't think our teammates are actually going to get to the cap. Unfortunately. Yeah, they're getting slapped about. He's silly currently. 
All someone has to do is just drive on the cab, dude. Just drive on the cab. Another one bites the dust. I don't have that guy for some reason. It's a BTR. Yeah, we, we are done. That's the best cast run I've ever had in this thing, probably. I'm not very good in it, usually. Oh my god. The lack of rudder is a problem. Oh, my teammate just died. No, he's, he's fine, but no one got to the cap in time. Oh, that was good, though. Thank you guys for watching today. I hope you enjoy this long form content of showing the entire battle. I get a lot of comments about you guys using this footage to help you get better at the game. So I'll just keep doing that. Now we have a list of vehicles to upload here. We've got the Flag Panzer 341, Coelian, the Elephant, the Sturm Tiger. We've got the Panther 2 as well to come along. And of course the Mouse and the E100. Let me know which one you'd like to see tomorrow. Of course, if you like this video, please hit the like button. That would really, really appreciate it. And of course, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. A huge thank you to everyone who supports the channel over on Discord and Patreon. To all the tier 3s who get a shout out. That's Ari, Sexy, White Wolf, Army Rebel, Bofi, Destari, Ezra, Titania, Fearless Germ, Goose Belly, Master Zain, Megu, Mushy Boy, Reaper of Souls, Rice Fields, Rusty, Satan Karma, Sazizar, Sniper, Rostoyan, Strike Noir, Wrecked Wolf and Zig. And to everyone over on Patreon, that's Matthew S, Paul Endrick, Cookie Muncher, Shane McGuire, Ahenius, Under Stormwind, NB1, Kenobi, Ethan, Excavation Nation, J Parambi, Love of Weasel, Maybe Cookie Muncher, Not Cookie Muncher, Ride Shaft, Circuit, thank you very much, Tectonic, thanks for well, The Anomaly, Mortan and David, Pyrophoric and The One, The Only, Rosalini and everyone else still here. Thank you very much for watching. Much love and bye-bye.